You can see the bare spot there. That's because there's a little less epoxy there. In that area. Um, then same thing on the bottom. And you can do this in a thousand different orders. I, I haven't really found something that is different from another. <coughs> Eventually this epoxy has got to migrate to the surface of the mylar. And, and you'll see that in some places it has, it's really thick and in some places it hasn't. And we'll, tr we'll make it so they all looks like, like it's soaked through to the, to the mylar. And once again, the, 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 the dye helps you <laughs> with that. There's three. And of course, I'm not anywhere near done. We're just getting the first coat on there. We'll spend the next 20 minutes getting the rest of it on. And you know, if you see any hairs, you can stop and pull them out. Whenever you see them, because you'll never get the chance again. It's actually, you'd be surprised, the ones on the outside pull off with, with mylar. The ones on the inside are the ones that show up. Okay, and now I will, in various ways, without wrinkling up the cloth, roll this back on. If you go out of 45, it doesn't stretch as much because it's on the bias, remember? But you don't have to do that. 